Hello everyone, my name is Malisha Eater and I am one of the college and career navigators here at the College of Lake County. Today we're going to be going, going over some general information about the College of Lake County to help you get a better understanding about CLC. And hello everyone, my name is Erica and I'm your college and career navigator for College of Lake County as well. Um, we are both here to answer any questions or concerns you have about CLC and walk you through some of our programs and opportunities that we offer here. If you decide that CLC is a good fit for you and your goals, we will continue to work with you on completing your application, help you complete the enrollment process, and help you select your first semester classes. So as Malisha mentioned, today we're going to go over a general overview of academics, financial, and social aspects aspects of CLC. There will be more videos to come that will go in more depth on these topics, so stay tuned. So the first thing I want you all to do is to whip out your smartphone and open that camera to scan the QR code that you see on your screen. This is going to take you to a link where we are going to be able to put in some of that general information, your name, your email, phone number, that kind of stuff. This will help you see this will help us be able to see who's in the room, who saw the video, and give us an opportunity to be able to follow up with you and answer any questions, start that dialogue, get to know you more, and see if CLC truly is a good fit for you. So while you're filling out that form, hopefully you've got it up already, um, we're going to go ahead and queue up this video to give you a sneak peek into CLC and what we're all about. No matter what your personal goals are, attending College of Lake County is the first step toward achieving your career goals. Teachers, engineers, artists, computer scientists, musicians. These are just a few of the career paths that have begun at the College of Lake County. CLC offers more than 40 transfer degree programs plus 200 different associate degree and career certificates. With campuses in Waukegan, Vernon Hills, Grays Lake, plus online, CLC makes learning convenient. With an average student to instructor ratio of 18 to 1, you're not just a number. You have access to experienced and knowledgeable teachers and mentors who care about your success. CLC offers tutoring in all three campuses, plus the Coaching for Academic Success program. Other resources include the Women's Center, LGBTQ Center, Multicultural Student Center, and Center for International Education. Gain leadership skills and make lasting friendships by joining one of 40 clubs and organizations. Explore new horizons and earn college credit by visiting other countries with CLC Study Abroad Program. The Honors Program offers a greater academic challenge and scholarships for ambitious students. If you're a high school senior, get ready for college with CLC's Summer Bridge Program. CLC also offers adult education classes, so it's never too late to get an education with CLC's ESL and GED programs. You can lead on the field as well as the classroom. CLC offers a variety of athletic teams for those who want to play competitively. With guaranteed transfer admission to more than 20 colleges, transferring is stress-free. At a third of the price of an Illinois public university, CLC is affordable and within reach. One of five CLC students receives financial aid. The college awards more than $15 million in financial aid yearly. And the CLC Foundation offers over 100 scholarships. Your goal is closer than you think. Connect to your future at the College of Lake County. Awesome. I hope you all enjoyed the video, got a little bit of taste, and then you feel a little bit inspired. So let's go ahead and start getting into a little bit of details at some of the great benefits at attending with attending CLC. So one of the great benefits, as you can see here, is our flexibility. Um, we serve all kinds of students that have unique backgrounds and needs. So it's important for us to be able to make sure that we're meeting those needs for the students, however it sees fit. So we offer daytime, evening, and even weekend classes. So if you work or have family responsibilities, or you're just simply particular about how you like to spend your time, we have a class that will be able to work around what you need. When I was in college, I worked third shift. So that was between 11 p.m. and 7 a.m. And so for me, it was important to have classes that were in that sweet middle between like 11 a.m. and 3 p.m. So I could take a nap after work, 
go to class, and then I can get some rest before I have to go back to work. So I was able to still be a full-time student and also make sure that I was tending to my responsibilities and my personal life. So that's a little anecdote that you could think of when thinking about how we can make sure that the schedule that you have works best for you. Um, additionally, if you're looking to maybe take an accelerated course, you don't have 16 weeks, we do have eight week options so that you can get that, um, that information, take that class and be able to get those credits. Otherwise, you can enroll in our typical 16 week courses. We also offer different models of instruction. So for our traditionalists in the room, you can take your class, you can have a class in the traditional classroom on campus. Um, if it's better for you to be able to take class at home or on the go, we do offer online classes. And if you, you know, have like a lot of different, you know, varieties in your day and you need both to be able to go in class and have online classes, we do offer a hybrid model where some of your classes will be on campus, but then some of them will be online. As you can see here, we also have three main campuses. So wherever you're located in the Lake County area, there's a campus that you know will be able to fit your commute. So we have a campus in Grays Lake, campus, um, our Lakeshore campus, which is located in Waukegan, and also South Lake Campus, which is located in Vernon Hills. So again, lots of flexibilities for you to pick what's right for you and to find a schedule that fits your needs. So after talking about schedule, let's talk about how we feel that schedule. And like, and that is thinking about what we wanna study and what that field of interest is. So, this sometimes is one of the hardest parts for students. It can be hard to narrow down all of the options that are out there and really like honing in on your interests and what you picture yourself doing um, and being happy doing. So on the screen, as you can see, we have, we offer a variety of fields that you can explore. There will be another presentation where we will go over some of the tools that you can use to help figure out your interests. And so don't feel like you have to answer this question today, but here are some of the field of interest that you can start thinking about um, as you're considering CLC as an option. And keep in mind, it's not just about finding the right fit and knowing what you want. Sometimes starting with what you don't want can lead you to the place that you wanna end up. So for example, math is not my thing. Um, and so when I was deciding what major I wanted in college, I knew that taking too many math classes was going to bum me out and it was going to make college not all that fun for me. So right there, I'm already ruling out business and information technology, manufacturing, engineering, and advanced technologies, and science and math. Another thing that I also know about myself is that I cannot really do the doctor thing. Like I have panic attacks every time a needle comes near me and blood makes me squeamish. So right there, I'm also ruling out health, um, wellness and health sciences. So just like that, I've narrowed down my, my options from nine to five, which is a lot more digestible. And I can really focus on the things that, you know, I wanna do. And of course, no shade to people out there who love the math and have no problem with needles. Again, those are things that if you know that about yourself, then consider that when you're making your choice on what you would like to study. So again, if it's hard to think about what you want to do, think about what you don't want to do. That could possibly be a good place to start. Now on to certificates. So at CLC, we don't just offer associate's degree um, and you don't have to be in school for two years. We do have a certificate programs that often take less than a year to complete and some can even be completed in 16 weeks. So in less time than pursuing a two year or a four year bachelor's degree, you can earn a certificate that will give you the credentials you need to go straight into the workforce and find a good and well-paying job. Our certificate programs offer hands-on learning. So what you learn in the classroom will be applicable to what you will be doing in the real world. So for example, automotive, welding, nursing, and as you can see, a hundred more. If you are interested in learning more about our certificate programs, again, stay tuned. We will have more presentations that will go more in depth with this information. In that same vein, we also offer career de degrees. So it's like a certificate, but with a degree. So 
we have over 40 programs and these take about two years to complete if you're a full-time student. So in this path, similar to a certificate program, you will be getting that hands-on learning experience. And what's nice about a career path is that it focuses on the area that you want to study. So while there are some general education courses that you'll need to take, like English, math, and some humanities, um, most of the classes you will be taking will be in your area of study. And that's nice because you can focus less on the classes that you don't like slash may not be your strong suit and be able to spend more time doing the learning and that you want to be doing and that you will hopefully enjoy. So as you can see here, only 15 of the 60 credits that you will need to earn to get that career associates is the general education courses and the rest are for you. So let me go ahead and transition us, uh, transition this to my colleague, Malisha, who will go in talking about our um, transfer opportunities at CLC. Thank you, Erica. So yeah, so <clears throat> for those of you guys um, for students who are wanting to do more of a transfer option. So you may not know what you wanna study or maybe you do, but you know that you wanna to go to a university. Then we offer a, a variety of different transfer options. So Erica explained what a career degree looks like. And so I'm gonna go ahead and show you how the transfer degree looks a little bit different. So when you're doing a transfer associates degree, you're basically working on the first year and a half that you typically would do at a university here at CLC. So you'll notice that you're taking a lot of those general education courses, you're taking those English, those sciences, the math classes, the humanities, fine arts classes, you're taking those here at CLC. Um, and then you have like for students who know what they want to study, then you have your area of concentration. So if I know I want to do business, then my area of concentration is going to be focused on um, business classes, accounting classes, um, those kinds of things. And same thing with like psychology. So you're still kind of getting a taste of what you're wanting to do and what major you want to do. Um, so you're still getting that little taste, but again, fulfilling those general education courses that are needed to when you go and transfer to a university. So there's a variety of different ways of transferring to a university. We have our Illinois Articulation Initiative, um, basically is an, uh, an agreement between the colleges within Illinois that says that general education courses are going to transfer to all the schools. So um, your English class at CLC will transfer to DePaul, will transfer to U of I, NIU, all of them. Our articulation agreement is an agreement, again, with um, colleges that um, have agreed that our classes will transfer over and they articulate over. Um, we have tons of different transfer resources and services. So for students who maybe don't know where they want to go, but again, know you want to transfer, we have tons of different um, resources that can help you with narrowing it down. Um, we also do also have the University Center, which is located right down the street from CLC, where if a student wants to get a bachelor's degree or a master's um, and some PhD programs, you are able to go ahead and take the classes here in Grays Lake um, and continue your education there. So for those of you guys who need to stay close to home, that's usually a good option. We also have something called the Guaranteed Transfer um, Pathways. So these are a list of schools. So we have over 30 different schools have, that have already agreed that CLC is a great place to start. They've agreed that if you take classes here at CLC, they guarantee you to get into their school and into their programs. And so um, any one of these schools you can transfer to if you utilize that guaranteed transfer path. Now, there are special requirements with that guaranteed transfer pathway. So you, you're gonna have to keep a certain GPA you're gonna to have to take certain classes, but most of them are about gen ed classes. So it's gonna be like English and you know psychology or um, math courses. So all of that stuff, once you decide you wanna go down this path, your um, navigator and your academic success advisor will walk you through all of those steps to let you know what is expected, what are the expectations and what you need to do in order to be able to utilize this pathway. So, We've talked about CLC in general, um, the fields of interest, being going into a career degree, going into a transfer degree, what that looks like. And so now it comes down to figuring out um, how much is it gonna cost? Because usually this is where um, students and families spend the most time. And I know parents are probably gonna sit up straight right now because this is it, these are the numbers, right? So let's talk about how much it's gonna cost to attend CLC. So you'll see here, this is our tuition. 
And so for in-district students living in Lake County, we charge $125 per credit hour. So it's all based off of the number of credits that you take. Now, these numbers are based off of students who are attending at the max of 15 credits. And so you may attend, you may be taking 12 or less. And so your tuition would change, but it's $125 per credit hour for tuition and then 22 for the fees. So again, for the semester, you're looking at $2,205 for one semester. For a full year, you're looking at $4,410. And so we've done a comparison of a public university and a private university, both of which are part of our guaranteed admissions program. And so if you look at NIU, um, and Eric and I are both uh, Huskies, so you know we love our Huskies, right? And so you'll see for one year at NIU, it's about $15,000, right? And so at DePaul, it's $40,000. So already, you know, you're saving a lot of that money. And so if you look at the red, basically it's explaining for a student who attends those universities for a full four years, that's how much it's gonna cost. The green is showing if you wanna go to these schools, cause our goal isn't to stop you from going. Our goal is for, to help you invest your money wisely because your education is an investment. And so we wanna make sure that you're investing your money wisely. And so if you attend CLC for two years and then go to one of these universities, it cuts down the cost. And so for NIU, it only costs about 38. For DePaul, it costs about 89. So you're saving about 20 to $71,000 for each of these schools, right? So that's a big chunk of change. And so that money can be utilized towards a lot of other stuff. And so again, when I talk about investing in your education, investing in yourself, this money that you can save can purchase these cars. And so if you want you know, to own your own car, maybe you don't want cars, maybe you just want a bunch, like I like shoes, maybe you just want to buy shoes. Um, maybe you want to travel and be able to just travel around the world. Maybe you want to get your master's degree, degree or your PhD, have a family, own a house, all that money can be utilized for something else. And so that's the whole point as far as saving the money and starting at CLC. It can definitely go a long way. And so that's a little bit about our cost and tuition, right? And so even with that, we still need to look at how are we going to pay for it, right? And so financial aid is a different, there's a bunch of different varieties of way of paying for school. So we have the primary way is FAFSA, right? And so this is a free application for federal student aid. This goes live October 1st. Every year, October 1st, the new one comes out. So if you're a senior and you're, starting um, college next year, October 1st, that's when you want to fill out every single year. And then juniors, like put it in your phone. I always say, put a reminder in your phone, October 1st, FAFSA. Um, because some of the money, um, which is particularly the grant money, um, it's first come first serve. So you do want to make sure you fill it out as soon as possible. So that way you can get as much money as you, you're eligible for. Okay, so there's just different varieties and this is all income based. So it's all determined off of your income as to what you're eligible for. At CLC, we also offer scholarships. So um, each navigator does a scholarship application drive at the schools. And so usually the typically we usually do that around February. And so you wanna make sure you're kind of keeping your eyes open for those scholarship application drives in February. For, my, um, for our DACA or undocumented students, um, I always use to explain like scholarships is a way to go. Don't let the fact that we can't fill out a FAFSA. We always have the alternative app. We have scholarships. Like there's different ways of paying for school. This Dreamer scholarship is a full to in, in district tuition and fees. And so again, just it's about learning about your resources and making sure you have um, you have that opportunity. We also have our Promise scholarship. Um, again, um, if you qualify for it then you're eligible for um, help with paying for your tuition. And so we've talked about um, finances. And so now let's kind of talk into, so like that part was kind of like for, you know, the families, right? For the, you know, the people who are all about the money who are like, I need to know the numbers. Now let's talk about kind of like the fun stuff, right? Student life. So why CLC, right? Everyone always talks about this college experience. It's all about the experience, right? And the experience is what you make it. So you can be at the best, you know, the top college. And if you don't get involved, you probably won't have a great time, right? And so it's all about getting involved and making your own experience memorable. And so real quick, I'm gonna go ahead and play this clip of a little bit about um, from our different students about 
what it's like to be at CLC. My name is Atazia and I'm from Antioch, Illinois. I chose to come to CLC because this is a great college. I just love the atmosphere. I love the vibe. Everyone is super kind, super nice and motivating. I chose to come to college because my parents would not have it any other way. College was mandatory. When I was looking at universities, I didn't want to pay for a house when paying for college. So ultimately the cost of paying out for myself, I chose CLC. There are so many great things about CLC. The best part in your classes, you meet great people. Everyone is so kind. It's diverse here, which you don't see everywhere. I have classes with people from every culture, every age range, everything. I knew I wanted to do something in medicine to help people, but I'm not sure exactly what yet, but I think CLC is a great way for me to find what I want to do. Another resource that I was familiar with was academic success coaches. These coaches are able to help you set your goals and help you achieve those goals. And the tutoring center is very beneficial to me. They help me solve problems that I'm not quite sure how to do. And even if I have the slightest question, it's nice to have someone there. I really like these small class sizes. I like being able to know that I can get help in all my classes as well, whether it be tutoring center, coaching for academic success, and many, many more. I also work here. I'm an intern for the Enrollment Services Department. And we also have lots of other student jobs on campus. If you want to learn how to play an instrument, maybe learn a new foreign language, you can do that at CLC. If you want to travel the world, CLC provides that opportunity. And if you're more lost like me, CLC can actually give you plenty of opportunities to find out what you're interested in and what your career could possibly be. By creating time to go to school, you are making that a priority and you will find time to finish it up. And even if you don't get the perfect grade you want, you can always retake the class and you can always keep going forward because that's the only way to finish. I'm the only member of my family that was actually born in the United States and money's always been tight. Um, really everything's always been tight. We've always kind of struggled, so college just seemed like a difficult thing. It wasn't until I got to CLC that I had a ton of openings in my schedule because of how like flexible the classes are. With people who share a culture with you is such an important thing that I had never really felt before because I had only really had friends who weren't Mexican and this is probably the first time in my life where I'm like oh cool I have earth science tonight can't wait to learn about that like I've never had a positive experience with education before I came here. The best part about attending CLC I would say is the staff and faculty you can really tell that they love their job and that they want to be here and that just makes the fact that I want to be here even more special um, it's just always so great when you come to school and you're welcomed and you have people who are fully invested in your education and that just enhances the experience overall. So again, just a little, um, some little stories from others, you know, past CLC students. And so um, again, you know, we want to go over all the different opportunities that you have here at CLC. So, oops, hold on. There we go. So let's talk a little bit about different support services. So there's a number of different resources and support services that students have here at CLC. The number one that I want you to kind of walk away remembering is your student success team. And so everyone has a college and career navigator to help walk them through the whole process from answering any of those, you know, beginning questions as to like, what kind of programs do you have, helping you um, explore different career options with doing a career assessment to applying, getting transcripts, doing placement testing, helping with FAFSA, um, scholarship filling, you know, completing the scholarship application to getting your first set of classes. And then after that, what will happen is then we turn you over to your field advisor or your academic success advisor. So you will then have someone else that we kind of hand you off to, um, to help you through the whole rest of your time here at CLC, to help you walk through the rest of your journey here at CLC, um, because you know we'll, we'll only be there for such, just a little time, right, um, Erica? We're only there just for a little bit, but you're in good hands afterwards. And so there's other things with like tutoring and academic support. Um, if you have IEPs or 504, we have our disability services, um, career and job planning placement. If you're needing help with finding a job before, um, after you get, get your degree or while you're still in school, um, they can help you with resume writing, interview skills, all those kinds of things. Um, student groups, so we have tons of different student groups and everything like that. 
we also have um, a athletic teams. So um, we have um, a bunch of different sports. These come, if you join one of our athletic teams, um, they can come with some scholarships as well. Um, so you do want to make sure you reach out to the coaches or let your college and career navigator know. They will go ahead and connect you with the appropriate coach. And then you can go about getting more information as to, you know, when do they do tryouts and what that all looks like. And like they mentioned in the video, we do have the study abroad program. So this is really nice. Um, this Again, this is the experience, right? If you're interested in traveling and you know seeing the different parts of the world, take advantage of the study abroad program. And so we have different types of um, study abroad programs. You can do a semester abroad, you can do short term trips, you can do trips within the United States that are only about like a week or two long. Um, and so just take advantage of them. Scholarships are also tied into this. So you may not even have to pay for it or pay little. Um, but it's nice because you can do, some of these classes are transferable credits. And so you can do an English class that would count as a gen ed, but you can do an English class in France instead of in Grays Lake or Waukegan or Vernon Hills. Like who wouldn't want to, I mean, there's, I'm sure there's someone who wouldn't want to do it, but I would love to do that. Um, so take advantage of that opportunity. And then we have an, another bunch of different services as well. So we have our gym that's free for all of our students. Um, we have our theater. So there's plays and shows that you can attend that students get a discounted pri um, price to the tickets. We have our like different services. So like our massage therapy um, program, they have a clinic, like you can actually make an appointment to get a massage. Again, it's it's at a, a, a lower cost. So it's, I think it's like $25 or something like that. You can get a massage, it's, it's great. Um, our dental hygiene program, they have a clinic in the downtown Waukegan area where again, you can get your teeth whitening, you can get your teeth cleaned at a fraction of a cost. So it's, it's great, it's phenomenal. Um, and then again, our 40 different, you know, over 40 different student clubs and organizations. If there's a club that you want that we don't have, you can make it. So I'm still waiting for a Harry Potter club. Anybody out there, let me know. <laughs> um, but you can make whatever club you want. So again, making that experience your own is really important when you're attending CLC. And so now I'm gonna go ahead and hand it back over to Erica to go over what the next steps are. Yes, next step. So I, um, after watching the video that we saw originally, I, I, you know, asked, I hope you all feel inspired. Now I really hope you all feel inspired because I know I do. Like I wish that, well, not I wish, I will one day become a Lancer myself. So let's talk about what it means to get started at CLC. So um, as you can see here on the sticky note, um, these are the steps that when we talk about as your college and career navigator, that we will support you on completing. So. Number one, complete the application. It takes less than 10 minutes to complete um, and you will be almost instantly accepted. You will receive your login information the next day and you'll be able to go ahead and get started on completing your enrollment. So what that means is submitting your transcripts and test scores um, and fulfilling whatever prerequisites um, that you need in order to take the classes that you will be registering for. Um, so for all you students out there that have been taking those AP classes or you're doing dual credit, um, you are already setting yourself up to um, have those prerequisites. And if not, that is okay. We do have placement tests that can help you place into courses that meet you where you're at and make sure that you are successful in those classes. Um, after that, we'll talk about financial aid. Um, make sure that you complete that FAFSA. Having that done as early as possible, as Malisha mentioned, will help us make sure that you're getting the money that you need. Um, and we'll answer any questions. We love to have conversations with your families to help you all feel comfortable about what um, about the money things. Um, after that, new student orientation, you know, uh, we'll, you'll go more in depth than what we did today to learn more about what you're getting yourself into when coming to CLC. And you'll also get like some next steps on um, how to continue your enrollment process. And then registration. Let's get those classes on the books. Let's go ahead and start envisioning what our first semester will look like. And then that's also where payment will come into play. So if you're a student that 
will be using financial aid. That money will get applied and you will be ready to take classes. And then for those who are um, hoping to be able to pay out of pocket, that will be the time that you would do that. And then we'll have new student convocation, which is kind of a big party where we welcome you to CLC, you get to meet your academic success advisor, um, and you really get to like understand, like, and then you get to connect with your field of interest. So you can really start understanding um, what you're gonna be possibly doing for the next semester, year, or two years, whatever um, path you chose. And so if you have any questions um, after today's presentation, go ahead and whip that phone back out and um, scan that QR code that you see on your screen. There you would be able to find our contact information and be able to find your CCN so that you can get started at, um, you can, so you can get the conversation started on if CLC is a good fit for you and we can help um, connect your goals to, uh, to, the next, to, the next, to the next step. Well, we just want to go ahead and thank everyone for joining us today. And if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to any one of us. So like Erica said, check out the um, QR code and the link to find your college and career navigator. And we'll be happy to start that conversation with you. Thank you and have a great day.